we were very punctual in starting tonight, so in case you're just joining us and missed the intro, we have Acker, and uh, we haven't talked to the guys yet, so would you guys like to introduce yourselves? I guess. Okay. And do, do you all have mics or somewhere that you can... I'm Michael. I'm Constantine. I'm Dan. I'm Jeremy. The guy I'm over here. So when I say Mike, both the front man and the sound engineer and the booking agent can all turn around. Yes. So uh, what would you like to lead off with? Uh, how, how did this happen? My friend Liz said, go practice with these guys she's doing music with. And that turned out to be you and Jeremy. And then we kept doing that. And then Dan showed up, and then like at the end of the summer, we were all really were stressed because we were recording an EP. And I'm still not sure why we did that, actually. I'm not sure how things progressed. And now we're here. Is this a commercial EP people can buy? Uh, yeah, yeah, you can get it from our band camp. We printed oh. them up. So yeah. there, there are hard copies? Uh, yeah, there are hard copies. Nice. I, don't, I don't know if we have any more, do we? We still have some if you want some, and you can buy them at acker.bandcamp.com. A C K E R all caps? Yeah. Yes. Yes. It's, it's a ruse. We, uh, we tell people they're on the radio, but they're not really. Oh, thank you. <laughs> so God. pressure's off. Everybody, off everybody who God. thinks they're hearing us out there, they're, they're just. You know, imagining things. God is good, dude. Watch out for that cat in the road. <laughs> <laughs> Man, if the people on the radio could see this right now. Okay. Come on, go. We should play music now. Yeah. So two more? Yeah, two more songs.
That was actually two songs as one song. Uh, anything you want to say or you want to keep playing? I, I guess I'll just remind people you're listening to WEFT 90.1 FM, and uh, I cannot say enough that our featured performer tonight is Acker. So uh, for anybody who's wondering who's on, it's Acker. We're about to record an album. Yeah, we are about to record an album, which... Tomorrow. Yeah, that's what we're doing tomorrow. Michael is, Michael is better at talking than I am. So. My mouth is messed up, though. That's true. <laughs> they can't see on the radio. I did want to ask. I mean, you, like, you we're going to record an album tomorrow. Yeah. Um, are, are you guys? Four days. Are you guys here for college? We, no, we're all out of school. We were at one point. Okay. Yeah. I was wondering. You know, some people they're born here. They point at the hospital. Some people are from Champaign. Some people are from Urbana, yeah. and then. We were born in hospitals. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. As far as we know. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Um, some of us are from. I'm from Illinois. I'm uh, You're from like Romania, right? Yeah, I'm a dirty foreigner. Yeah, yeah, okay, he's a dirty foreigner. Dan, you're from like Kentucky? Yeah, the, the no, where are you from though? Mike, the, the Romanians are taking over the show. <laughs> you know Remy, right? Uh, oh. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, we should play music now. Yeah, we should.
I think it's close enough to 10.30 that we can go ahead and do our 10.30 break and say you're listening to WEFT 90.1 FM Champagne. Now, if the FCC were, if I trusted them to be listening at 10.20, they'd know I already just said that. But uh, better to say it two, three times than not at all. So We, uh, we let them know we were playing. They're listening right now. We, we like to know that, uh, uh, yeah, anyway. Uh, Sorry, everybody. So, uh, you're listening to Acker on Web Sessions, and I understand we have people listening from Kentucky tonight. I'd like to say hi to them. And, uh, hi, Dan's mom. Hey, guys. Hi, mom. Also, hi, from, mom also from North Champaign, so uh, all the way over there. Woo-hoo. And uh, so far, pretty good listenership uh, up from the last couple of weeks. That's certainly appreciated. Yeah. Any kink of tea? I, uh, you know, they used to joke about a board that lit up all over the US map, but uh, unless people tell us where they're listening from, it's kind of hard to know. So (laughs) if you're in Kankakee and you're listening and uh, you are not in federal prison, please let us know. (laughs) And uh, (laughs) Um, not in federal prison? In Kankakee. Oh, okay. I don't don't like to assume and be wrong, so it gets awkward. So, uh, anything else? Uh, I don't think we've given out uh, if you have any upcoming gigs or uh, website for booking upcoming gigs. Uh, I'm playing in Chicago this Saturday at Quenchers. Yeah, this Saturday, so if anybody happens to be in Chicago, by all means. What time and who else is on the bill? Uh, We're going on at 10. Who are the other bands? One Um, of them's math misspelled. Math. We're actually playing around here on the 26th. So. They're good. And uh, then Arbor, I think? Yeah. Tr- uh, all yeah. I know is all the band names have five letters. Arbor, so. British. Yeah. <laughs> I guess yeah. Oh, yeah. Arbauer? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Not that they say it that way, but that's how we say it on the radio when we want to s- be extra British without being able to pull off the accent. Respect. Yes. Um, okay. yeah. As you were, gentlemen?
I probably should put a few words in. Uh, I would like to thank the caller from Urbana, who uh, let us know that people are indeed listening locally. And uh, listenership has actually surged since I said that. So uh, it always amazes me. I can talk about listenership and people who weren't listening. It's like they hear and they tune in. But uh, logic tells me otherwise. I'm just happy, and I hope they stay tuned in. I hope they, do. I hope they Even feel like done. staying tuned in. I don't want to pressure them. I want them to do it because they like it. And, and if, if they don't like it, then I'll pressure them. But So uh, let's see. We talked about website. We talked about gigs. We talked about your record. You still have some, your EP, and there's another record on the way. Uh, let's see. What does that leave? Um, How do you think we're doing so far? Sounds good to me. And uh, the, uh, the previous uh, Jess, uh, Je Jess is new to us. Jess, uh, Jess also gave a thumbs up. So. Thanks, Jess. Yeah. So, and I figure anything that, uh, almost anything that uh, produces a spike in listenership must be doing something right. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's the in-between songs that we're not good at because we're terrible at yeah, talking, this is, but we this shouldn't is, talk. This is the weak part of the set, as we like to call it. Well, what are your, uh, your tiger beat roles in the band for all the uh, <laughs> girls that aren't old enough to be interested in you? Um, Michael's the cute one. They switch off. Yeah. Jeremy's the shy one, though. See, there could just be a band where everybody's brooding, but it's mad, it's degrees. You could have the cute brooding one. You could have the... Uh, I, I, I wouldn't want anybody to be like the opposite of the cute brooding one, because that would be insulting. But By saying that there's only one cute brooding one, are you implying that only one of us is cute? I'm not really because looking at all four of you as I'm talking. I'm just <laughs> staring off into space. I'm not really interested in uh, cute, you know... Uh, I, I'm not the 11-year-old uh, readership. Because <laughs> we're, we're in Tiger Beat next week. So. Excellent. Well, it's good that you brought this up. I hope everything I'm not picking up on resonates there. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, okay. we're still waiting a and I'm just avoiding right. making a Judge Judy joke. So. <laughs> okay. Um, we should play some more songs, though. Can yeah. we play covers? Uh, the, the only issue with covers is if you, we're, we're giving you a CD of the show, um, we cannot authorize you to sell the cover without checking with the original artist. Uh, if it's all originals, then you can just sell it as is. But uh, if you're tight with Aerosmith or whoever you're covering, then uh, still no worries. We are tight with them, but we're not covering them tonight. Ah. Um, shall we start? Yeah, yeah start. I guess we should start. Yeah. Oh God, this is the one that I said.
I can make this quick. Do you know how many more you have? No. One. Yeah, we got one more. Only one more. Uh, then I won't make it quick, because if you only have one more, then I need to talk longer. Don't worry. Uh, we could do no, two longer. more. Do two more. Do, do. Oh, no, no. Oh, okay. Uh, I was just given some messages. First of all, your uh, your listenership really went up. Uh, so keep up the... It's not too late to uh, max out the stream, but uh, we heard from... Uh, I think Lori said uh, Foamy offered her regards. I assume it's a she. Like the, like Foamy. The I, I am not familiar That's with... I know Dow scrubbing bubbles. That's about my only association, but... Uh, um, and uh, somebody wanted to know about advanced tickets at Quenchers. I didn't think they did advanced tickets, but actually, uh, you. I think it's on the Facebook event. Okay. Yeah. If well, you like, I. If you like us on Facebook, you can. We post links to all the shows, and this is actually the first one. Is it the first one that you can buy tickets in advance? Oh, well, I'm learning something here. Yeah. No. This See, it's an educational. You can buy advanced tickets on the Facebook event. Yeah. Educational programming on yeah. WEFT. This the is, host learns this something. This is one of our shows that's like through a booking company and all this wow. crazy stuff. It's, it, it's weird. Now, I also saw that the uh, CD that you have, the EP, uh, there, it looks like the way it operates on Bandcamp is there's like a tip jar. Is that right? Yeah. yeah. It's, it's Pe- yeah, if you want to, if you want to just download it, it's pay whatever you want. Zero is a perfectly fine amount to pay. We won't judge you too much. People can preview it, and then they can... Uh, yeah, they can, they can listen to it online. They throw some doubloons at you. If they want. Um, but you can also buy physical stuff through Bandcamp, so you have the option of buying the actual CD, and we'll, we'll mail it to you, and you'll make us oh so happy. Is this something you'd want WEF to play, or would you prefer we wait for the uh, full length? Uh, if you guys want to play stuff, uh, what do you think? Yeah, Go either way. Well, if you have any, we'd... Uh, We'd be, I mean, obviously, we've just you've played for an hour, so we'll play somebody else <laughs> now. But uh, uh, I did promise the, uh, let's see, Bailiff and Lonely Trailer and uh, whatever Billy, but some Billy Corgan, yeah. Zwan, Zwan. We have Zwan, Zwan over Zwan. there. Why? If you'd rather hear Zwan. No. <laughs> Everybody would rather hear Zwan, right? Oh, yeah. Because <laughs> the sure if, if, if you blinked, you missed them the first time. <laughs> no, we have the future. Em- we actually have... Get, believe it or not, we have the Future Embrace, and we have an EP off the Future Embrace that is only tracks on the Future Embrace. There's nothing exclusive. Oh, that's a bummer. So I was like just noticing it's... about that just sounds the worst. <laughs> Somebody was just talking in here the other night about uh, when you get Robert Smith to do a Bee Gees duet with you. Because uh, that's on there, you know. Wait, what? Uh, one of the singles off uh, the Future Embrace was uh, Robert Smith from The Cure singing an early Bee Gees song with Billy Corgan. And uh, this is it was the first time I've ever been interested it, in that. Album. It was wow. Inter- well, the interesting thing about that album is it, it was to- it was a top forty seller in Illinois, and in the other forty nine states, it just tanked. <laughs> so you look at the local charts; You're it's welcome. like, oh, this is popular. And then you look at you know Rhode Island and Oregon and Louisiana, and it's like, what album? How many so, live in Rhode Island uh, you, you know, not They're a lot of, four of them Rhode Island is Rhode Island and Michigan, I think, are the two states the most people are leaving. But uh, if you're listening from there and you love it, I'm not trying to... We're, uh, this is a place of healing, as a friend of mine likes to say. So uh, we, we are not judging you for living in a uh, state that is uh, bleeding off the economy or something. <laughs> you know, glass houses we're, and all that. We're here to play instrumental music and insult and other we, states. And we love Kentucky because we have multiple listeners tonight from Kentucky that are not all even... So at least one of them has never met you guys, unless you're holding out. So, uh, so yeah. Uh, Acker, what's the what's the URL? Uh, Acker.bandcamp.com. Oh, that's simple. I yeah. thought that would be taken already. I guess it is by you. Facebook.com/slash/AckerMusic. If you have Facebook, then uh, go there. Yeah. Yeah. Anything else before this uh, last? I guess just uh, please uh, if, please consider staying tuned for another hour of local music immediately to follow. And thanks to the studio audience and uh, Mike Ingram and Mike Feldman and everybody else who, uh, and Acker, of course. Thanks, guys. <laughs>